Resurrection is um, very, very important to me. It means that um, it means that Jesus is alive, and you know that that's what my faith is all about. If if Jesus didn't raise from the dead, then my faith would be worth nothing. And um, so Jesus is alive, and I know that He's with me all the time. He's with me. Every single day I get up in the morning and I know that Jesus is with me and that whatever I face during that day, I've got that peace knowing that, you know, Jesus is with me and I'm not alone. He's guiding my path. He's protecting me. He's providing for me. Um, and it's, it's just a real comfort to know that, you know, Jesus is with me all the time and that he's alive. Um, the other wonderful thing about the, the resurrection is that you know the bible promises that those who believe in me will have eternal life and you know that's that's wonderful that is just you know that gives you such hope um i'm not scared of death i'm not scared at all of dying because i know i'm going to heaven and i know that i'm going to spend eternity with my father in heaven The historical fact of Jesus' resurrection shows that he wasn't just a good man, he was who he said he was, the Son of God. Because he didn't just overcome death for himself, he was re-establishing creation, the whole of creation, with its eternal creator God, overcoming the power of sin, our sin. He told Mary, I am the resurrection and the life. Whoever believes in me, though he dies, he shall live. When I was born, the resurrected Jesus spoke my life into being. And when I die, he will speak my eternal life into being. And yours too, if you believe in him. The resurrection is the ground of our assurance it is the basis of all our hopes and is the source of power in our daily lives here and now it gives us courage in the midst of persecution it gives us comfort in the midst of trials and hope in the midst of the darkness of the world and basically it is who jesus is it's believing that he did die on the cross he was able to remove sin and its penalty by taking command over death and satan he didn't win it's part of god's salvation plan it's every it's the subject of every sermon in the book of acts and it's knowing that if there was no resurrection there's no christian faith and that's what we hold on to and like i said at the beginning it's our hope it's our comfort it's knowing who we are in christ and basically I can sum her up as he paid a debt he did not roll I owed a debt I could not pay I needed someone to wash my sins away and now I sing a brand new song amazing grace Christ Jesus paid a debt that I could never pay and that's what Jesus resurrection means to us he said what he was going to do and he done it 